Hello everyone, I'm CryptoNobs. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the latest big news to do with Cardano. We're also going to be taking a look at price analysis too. So if you guys like anything I bring to you, don't forget to smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, or share the video for more. Let's see if we can get this video with 500 likes, and I also want to know down below, are you planning on holding or selling your Cardano this bull run? With that, let's jump straight into the video. Just quickly, I just want to bring you a quick update to do with the Nob stake pool. Recently, we have hit 21 delegations and 406,000 Cardano staked with the Nob stake pool. I just want to say a massive thank you to every single person that has been staking with us so far, and I have some good news. Recently, I was told by my team that the Nob stake pool is going to be seeing its first rewards. Our luck has been absolutely incredible for this one, and it means we are going to be seeing a 344% luck slash performance increase, which means the people that have been joining the Nob stake pool will see a 3.4 times increase the normal rewards. If you want the chance to see possible rewards like this, do not forget to join Team Nobs. Thank you so much to everyone that has been a part of this so far, and thank you to everyone in the future. If you guys do have any questions regarding staking whatsoever, please leave them down in the comment section down below and I will get back to you as soon as possible. So we're going to jump straight into the first article before we take a look at how Cardano's price is doing. And this article says, Cardano, IOG launches multi-asset Deadless Wallet ahead of Mary. IOG launches the first version of the Deadless Wallet that supports the Mary features on Cardano's public testnet. The release will feature a new user interface for sending and receiving native assets on Cardano. The Mary Hardfoot Combinator event will introduce multi-asset features to the Cardano mainnet today, March 1st at 9.44pm, with the launch of Epic 251. In preparation for this, Cardano developer IOG has released a new version of the Deadless Wallet with the new features. The new Deadless version will initially be available on Cardano's testnet and will allow developers and state pool operators to transfer ADA and native assets. The new version of Deadless will also have a new user interface. IOG added, Tomorrow evening UTC will release a Deadless flight wallet, timed with the Merry Hard Fork. Then, after a final user experience testing with our community of power users, and will do final integrations and release a full deadlist for everyone. As reported by Crypto Newsflash, Mary is the second of three hard fork combinator events designed to implement smart contract capabilities of Cardano to fully roll out the Gogan era. The next HFC Alonso will be activated somewhere in Q2 2021 and will introduce deployed Plutus and with that smart contract capabilities of Cardano. So overall it has been an incredibly big day for all Cardano holders. We are now starting to see the future of Cardano being built at an incredible pace. This is a big milestone and we still have many more to come. And to confirm that everything went perfect with Cardano, here's a tweet by OHK. Mission accomplished. We can confirm that Cardano Mary protocol update was successfully applied to the Cardano mainnet tonight at 9.44 USTC via a managed half fork combinator event. Welcome to the beginning of an exciting new multi-asset era on Cardano. And it says down here a key milestone in its ongoing rollout. This update introduces core cool Gogan features of native token functionality and multi-asset support. An important building block and foundations for exciting new use cases for Cardano. ADA holders today can download a new Deadless Flight release or use the latest Aurora to check out new features. After final acceptance testing with our flight program, a fresh Deadless will come next with full Cardano token registry integrations. To find out more on what to expect, over the next week or two in our native token age here's a rundown from our blog if you guys do want to check this out i am going to leave a link in the description so if i bring you to the roadmap we are currently at stage two out of three for gogan and when that happens for three out of three that is when smart contracts will be fully out and that is when you will see the true growth of the cardano ecosystem but i want to know down below when was the first time you heard of cardano now this is the last article i want to show you before we take a look at a clip from charles hoskinson and a price analysis and this one says cardano Cardano's ADA token tripled in February to outperform Coindesk Top 20. Traders are betting on the smart contract blockchain which aims to compete with the market leader Ethereum, even though it doesn't yet have smart contract functionality. Cardano, a smart contract blockchain, is aiming to rival market leader Ethereum. It tripled in February to dominate performance rankings among the top 20 digital assets. The gains came during a bullish month across the board for cryptocurrencies, with Bitcoin the largest posting a 36% return, Ethereum, the second biggest and the native token of the Ethereum blockchain, climbed 7.4% in the month. But it was Cardano and Ethereum alternatives that topped the rankings. Aside from the 274% gains for Cardano's token, the Atom token from Cosmos rose 122% based on Coindesk pricing. Cardano's gains were so impressive that its market capitalization climbed to about $40 billion, becoming the third most valuable digital asset and vaulting past cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin Cash and Litecoin that had led the industry standings in recent years. XRP, the token used in Ripple Labs payment network, fell 15% on the month. ADA climbed to a new all-time high of $1.49 on February 27th, topping the peak price at $1.30 
reached an early 2017 at the tail of the end of the last bull market. So overall, bearing in mind February is only two months into the start of the year, Cardano has been one of the standout performers so far. Because of the big news that we had today, I am expecting a slight pullback, but apart from that, I think Cardano's future is looking incredibly bright. It has been one of my most talked about cryptocurrencies on this channel since we made it, and for very good reasons. If you guys remember Cardano below 10 cents, make sure you leave a comment down below as you are a veteran. We're now going to take a look at a clip from Charles Hoskinson and a price analysis. The commercial side of this project is waking up, and we're going to bring all new experiences to those who really want to innovate and build great things. They're coming to us. We're not even asking. Hundreds flooding in saying, gosh, when can we get started? We say, grab a shovel, become a Plutus pioneer. Let's get it done. At the end of this month at Cardano 360, you'll see how much enthusiasm, passion, and excitement there really is in the developer class and how they really want to get started. We're the bottleneck, not them. It's not uh, build it and let's see. It's uh, let's get it done because there's a big crowd outside and they're going to start setting fires if we don't get it done quickly. That's exciting. Last time I saw that was at the Foundations of Ethereum at the Miami uh, conference when Vitalik delivered his speech showing how to do some things. And as he left the conference room, he was like a rock star surrounded by all these people. That enthusiasm, passion, and moment is back. And it's here. And wow. Just wow. I cannot wait for the next uh, nine months, guys. I, I really can't. It's going to be so much fun. I get to travel around the world again and meet all of you in person. We get to build so many cool things. We get to explore so many cool ideas. And that's just this year. And before the end of this year, we get to talk about where we're going over the next five years and how do we leverage what we have built, which is here to stay, to take over the world. And you know what? We're crazy enough that we might actually do it or at least make a big ass dent. You with me? You are. Congratulations, everyone. Enjoy this moment. To finish off the day's video, we are going to be taking a look at a quick little price analysis. And if I show you this chart here, as you can see, this is what Cardano has done in the space of one month. We ended up going to the levels of 36 cents all the way to the levels of $1.50, which is absolutely incredible. We are now starting to see a slight correction period because the news is out and now we are starting to accumulate sideways. I personally think that the worst case scenario for Cardano is that we will take a pullback to the levels of $1.16 or $1.10 purely because a lot of people are going to be selling due to this news. But as you can see since the hard fork has come out we are still having a lot of buyers because a lot of people believe in the future of Cardano. For the incredibly short term I am bearish on Cardano but that does not mean I am not going to be buying some, that means I am going to be buying more. When Cardano goes down in value and there is a big correction that is when I am personally buying more because Cardano's value in the future is going to be worth 10 times more than what it is today. If you are thinking when is a good time to buy Cardano considering its current price I personally would hold off just a couple of days to see what direction the market is headed in as well as Cardano purely because we have been in a very volatile market over the past couple of days. We have seen very many corrections, but again, Cardano has been in a very bullish direction, purely because of the news. If Bitcoin and Cardano are in a bullish direction, then now could possibly be a good time to buy, considering we know the capabilities of the market in such a short period of time. If we do get lucky and we do see a big pullback to the levels of 70 cents or below, yes, it would be very, very scary. But again, the amount of times that this crypto market has recovered is absolutely unbelievable. So again, buy the dips, accumulate what you can and hold for the future because this road is a very long road. And if I show you a quick update of the Bitcoin stock to flow, as you can see, even with the current correction that happened with the market, we are still perfectly on course to be seeing Bitcoin over 100k by the end of the year. If Bitcoin hits over 100k by the end of the year, where do you honestly think some of the top cryptocurrencies like Cardano will be price-wise? I personally think at a ridiculous level. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that is absolutely everything I've got for you in today's video. If you have enjoyed anything I've brought to you, don't forget to smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, or share the video for more. Let's see if we can hit that 500 like target, and I also want to know your thoughts and opinions down below. If you do want to join Team Nobs, or you're thinking about joining Team Nobs, but you have no idea, then simply leave a comment down below, and I will help you to the best 
best of my ability. If there are any whales out there that will be willing to help my pool get out there more, it would be incredibly appreciated. Staking, especially with Cardano, is the future. With that, I've been CryptoNobs. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, I'll see you in my next video. Peace.